What's up Flash crew? Welcome back to the Flash Shop. Today we've got another Pokemon TCG opening for you. And today we'll be opening the Reshiram and Charizard GX and the Pikachu and Zekrom GX boxes. I am so so excited for these. These are the premium collection boxes. I'm so so excited that they bought back Tag Team GX on this. But here we go. We have the Reshiram and Charizard. We have Zek Pikachu and Zekrom. You guys know I am a huge Zekrom fan. I love Zekrom. So to have Zekrom, I was like, I need to get my hands on this. Let me guys show you what we get in both the boxes. You basically get the same things except for the promo cards itself. The promo cards are the only difference in this. Otherwise, you get basically the same thing. But it says over here, there's 10 booster packs. So we have 10 booster packs. And you can see over here, we have three Evolving Skies, two Chilling Rain. I think there's more Chilling Rain and Evolving Skies. You can see over there, guys. Chilling rain over there, but there's more chilling rain and a bit more evolving skies. So you get 10 booster packs. I think it's five, five each. Five evolving skies and five uh, chilling rain. But you can see over here one go for a card featuring Reshiram and Charizard. One jumbo card, the oversized card featuring Reshiram and Charizard. You also have 10 Pokemon TCG booster packs and a code card for on uh, TCG online, which is really, really cool. Before we break open into these boxes, make sure to leave a like and subscribe now. We're getting closer to our goal of a thousand subscribers every day. And I'm super, super appreciative of all the support you guys, but make sure to subscribe right now. All right, let's get into this. I'm not gonna wait to keep you guys waiting any longer. So about 65 to 70 Singapore dollars and with 10 packs, and let's assume each of these packs is $5 each, 10 packs, $50 there. And these promo cards have been going for about 16 to $20 together as a set. So overall, it makes pretty good sense. And on face value, this is quite a, this is a box that is pretty worth it, I'd say. But let's see, I think the other question a lot of people wanted to ask is, do you get hits from this box? There we go, the Reshiz Reshiram and Charizard GX Gold card. And we also get this amazing jumbo card. Look at this. Do you guys have any jumbo cards of your own? Put it down in the comments right now. Also, if you guys have opened this, these boxes, I'm gonna put this aside. If you guys have opened these boxes, uh, make sure to comment down what you've pulled from them so we can get a better view of, you know, how the hits are from this box. I'm only opening one box each, so I'm not a good sample size altogether. Three Evolving Skies, we have five Chilling Rain, and we have two Vivid Voltage. I don't know why they're giving so much love to Chilling Rain, but let's go. We're gonna open up all of these here on the Flash Hub. All right, guys, here we go. We have 10 packs in total from this box itself. Three Evolving Skies, five Chilling Rain, uh, two Vivid Voltage over here. So let's go and open this up right now and see what the hits are in this Reshiram and Jarzad box. All right, guys, so first pack, here we go. Oh my God, it's a white Coca already. Holy crap, guys, the hits are good. The hits are great. The hits are freaking great already. All right, let's do this. Treasure Energy, Digging Gloves, Palpitone, Cutie Fly, Applin. Ooh, save. Oh my god, I've already let go, but we got the Galarian Zapdos. Oh no, I messed up. I messed up the opening, but there we go, a Galarian Zapdos. What followed after this was the worst green code card run ever. Oh my god, are you dumb? Okay, so in this box of 10 packs, three from Evolving Skies, five from Chilling Rain, and two from Vivid Voltage, we've gotten one white code card, which gave us this Galarian Zapdos. The rest have all been green code cards. The hit rate in this is not, is non-existent. You know what, let's move on to this. Let's move on to our favorite, my favorite, Zekrom and Pikachu, I hope. Zekrom doesn't let me down. Please, Zekrom, don't let me down. I hope that we can get something. Can I just say, I prefer this Zekrom Pikachu gold card over that Reshira and Charizard so much more. I think I'm just a big Zekrom fanboy. What do you guys think of the, uh, of the gold promo cards? I absolutely love them. I'm so glad they brought that back. 
There we go. Look at this. Z Pikachu and Zekrom just being badass as usual. There we go. Look at this sick Zekrom and Pikachu. And then, of course, we have the bad boy Jumbo card over here, which is insane. I love this. Honestly, guys, that gold card has been the best hit of the day so far, which is kind of sad to say. We have three Vomis, guys. We have... Uh, five chilling rain again and two battle stars battle stars and chilling rain have not given great hit rates so you know what i'm gonna get these over with and i'm gonna keep put my trust in evolving skies to have something there hopefully you can get more white coca the last box only had one white coca which is in insanely bad that that's a horribly bad hit rate right there so hopefully this box the zekrom box doesn't let me down let's do this guys Oh my god, it's not a good start. Battle Styles is not a good start. This is why I put Battle Styles first. I know the hit rate isn't great. The hit rate is just not great at all in Battle Styles. Final Battle Styles pack. Please. It is a white code card. Okay, so we did get a white code card. Hopefully, it's a full art hit. Phoebe, Carnivine, Cacnea, Pawnyard, Timber. Let's get closer. Tepic. I think I see a hit. Silly Cobra, Frillish. Oh, I think it's a V. Ooh, okay, a Flapple V. Not bad, not bad. Not the alternate arts or anything which we know is Balsals is really good for, but still a hit and I will definitely take that one. And yes, there we go. Finally, Chilling Rain comes through with a white coat card and already we have beaten the previous box in three packs. We've already beaten the previous box with two white coat cards. And ooh, a Porygon Z. That's a sick, that's a sick hollow pull though. This is, this is, uh, we still have three more packs of Chilling Rain, including this, and it's a white coat card. Three packs of Chilling Rain, and also three more packs of Evolving Skies. So I'm really trusting Evolving Skies to end this video off with a bang. All right, let's do this. Unlisted Leaf Energy. Oh, okay. Athena, Bounce Sweet, Furfru, Diglett, Larvesta, Single Strike, Urshifu. Okay, okay. And, oh! Oh! We hit the place it can be max alternate art! No way! No way! We hit the blaze it can be max alternate art from chilling rain! Holy shit! No way! Just without saying, hopefully you can get it all hopefully we can get some but there we go! A blaze it can be max alternate art and holy shit, this is amazing! This is so sick. Yo, look at this. There we go, guys. Let's take a look at this. Blaziken VMAX alternate art. What a pull. What a pull, everybody. Look, 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 look. I'm speechless. I'm speechless. Look at this absolute beautiful card. This Blaziken VMAX. Holy shit, let's go. An alternate art was pulled today. The Zekrom box has not let me down at all. But we still have five more packs to go. So we still have two Chilling Rain packs and three Evolving Skies packs. So hopefully you can get some more great, great cards. Hope I'm, wow, I don't think there's any way we can beat that unless you get like a Gold Snorlax. And we're back down to Earth with a Green Cold card. There we go. I can't believe you did. This is my first, this is my first like alternate art pull from, oh my God, it's another White Cold card. Yo, this, this box's Chilling Rain is not letting us down. This box Chilling Rain is not letting us down at all. Hopefully you can get something. Let's go, Fighting Energy. Come on. Marie, Rockruff, Swirlix, Lapras. Oh, that's sick. Oh, I got two. Steeny and a Rillaboom Hollow. There we go. Oh, that's pretty sick as well. Oh, it's backwards. Oh my God, it's a green Coca. It was backwards. Uh, if all my skies has not started well, everybody. The code cards are like this, and there's another green code card. No. If all my skies, I trusted you to end off with a bang. The last pack of the box, I'd say, of course, this box was pretty worth it. This box was pretty worth it. Uh, the hit rates in this box, the Zekron box, was pretty good. But let's see. It is a white code card. Oh my god, guys, can we do it? All right, guys, here it is. White code card. Can we get? Two alternate arts in the same box. Let's go. Under Sleep Energy. Boldor. Flur. Uh, single Strike. Glossy Fleur. Slacket. 
Volga, Kavana, Bergmai, Lantern, and it's a holo hit though. Wait, what? What? Hello? What the hell? I've been robbed. I've been robbed. Wait, wait a minute. This was a white coca. I've been robbed. Oh my god, look. I've been robbed. No, this white coca is a fake white. It's a fake white. It's an error card. It's an error pack. It has a white coca, but no hit. It's basically a green coca pack. No, I was fooled. I was robbed. No. Thousands of tears later. It's okay. It's all right. But <laughs> what can I say though? I am definitely thought we could have pulled another alternate art from that, but hey, it's okay. All right, so the Zekrom box was pretty damn good. Honestly, we had one, two, three, uh, and four, and f five white code cards out of ten booster packs, and one of them had this insane Blaziken V Max, which is crazy, right? Absolutely crazy. Let's take a look at this card though. Made by Shigenori Negishi. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that correctly, but there we go. What a card. What an artwork there. But there you go. Huge Blaziken V Max. Looks in really good condition. Uh, centering a bit off. You can see it maybe slightly thicker on the right than the left. I don't know if you guys can tell on video from the camera, but this is what I can see over here. Uh, that's just the, that's just the sleeve. Nothing on the card. Slightly thick on the right and the left. Uh, on the right, then compared to the left, the top and bottom look okay. But either way, what a card to pull, guys! What an absolute banger of a card to pull in the second box. I'm so happy. This is my first proper hit from Chilling Rain, and to for it to be this Blaziken V Max is so so sick. Also, guys, even though the boxes were the first box at least wasn't the best, these cards are absolutely insane. Can I just stick? Can we just appreciate how insanely cool and good looking these cards are? We have Reshiram we have Reshiram and Charizard just wow, this is so cool. Of course, taking from the original artwork as well. And then we have Pikachu and Zekrom. The gold cards in person just look amazing. I don't know if the camera can do it justice, but the gold cards in person just look really, really cool. So it's it's really sick to see this. It's really sick for them to bring back this Tag Team GX promo packs, of course. Wow, I'm I'm happy with the boxes we've got. The first box, not so much. The, the Reshi's the Reshi's art box, not really the best. But I would say the Zekrom box really got me. But looking to worth into the worth of it, I think at face value, like I said before, this boxes these boxes are really worth. If you want to sell those like packs itself, uh, or just sell everything inside as a box, I think it's pretty worth. Opening wise, as you guys can see, the first box was horrible. That first box was insanely bad. Like, I've never had 10 packs and I've originally one being a hol one being a white coke card and from different uh from different eras, from different like sets as well, and have one code card for it to be the one bird which I'm not really a big fan of. Yeah, I don't know how, how that sits with me. But either way, it's okay. I think the second box is really, really good. Five white code cards. You got two full art hits. One being a Flapple V and the other being that Blaziken V Max alt art. And I cannot get over the fact that we've just pulled another alternate art on this channel. The streak continues, guys. Alternate arts are coming in all the time. I'm so, so happy with this. So I'd say this box is pretty worth it overall. Not saying that just because of the Blaziken V Max, but overall, I think if you just look at it, the number of packs you get, the gold cards which you get are really, really cool as well. And everything to go with it is just really good. I think overall, it's a very worth box to get. If you guys did get your hands on some of these, uh, put it down in the comments. What are your pulls from it? What do you guys think of the box, especially the gold cards, the, uh, the promo cards, both the jumbo and the regular sized one. The gold foil cards are so good. Honestly, they're so good. But let me know what you guys thought of it. Till then guys, this is the Flash Hub. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed this. Sub leave Subscribe right now if you enjoyed this. This is so sick. Subscribe for that Blaziken V Max. Oh, it's so sick. I can't believe we pulled it. But anyways guys, this is it for this video. There'll be definitely more videos coming out throughout December. So stay tuned for that. Till then guys, this is the Flash Hub. And I'll see you guys in the next video.